Hey, my biker chicks. It's AG Mama Badger, and uh, I'm getting ready for the day. And I thought, you know what? I'm gonna come on here while I'm getting ready and chat with you guys. So I did a thing. I am 44, just turned 44 last week, and I decided after long, 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 many years of um, whether or not I want to get a nose ring. And uh, I don't have the most beautiful nose, but I'll tell you how I've overcome my insecurities. Be right back. side profile my beautiful nose which I inherited from my dad and of course my grandma my I've never liked it it's been something I've had a hard time with when I was in high school and um, yeah I always thought oh when I get older I'm gonna get a nose job and funny thing is, you know, as I got older, I started, I started looking more and more like my dad and, um, and my grandma and I'm six foot tall and I have this, I have this cute, cute, tiny, petite little grandma. I mean, she's short and cute little thing. And I was like, you know, I really looked up to her and my dad and I thought, you know, as I got older, I'm just like, this is me, right? This is... This is who I am and um, you know they're proud of it that's they've been living with it all these years why can't why can't I right so um, yeah so I decided no I'm gonna keep this face and then as I got older the funny thing is I met Sunny which is real name is Sunny and um, people started calling me Cher <laughs> with the dark hair and the nose, and I'm like, this is kind of funny. I'm married to a guy named Sonny. I look like Cher. He is definitely shorter than me. Uh, so, you know, I don't know. I just embraced it more and more. But I always thought people look so cute with a nose ring, and um, I thought, man, I would love to do that, but I'm sure I would draw more attention to my nose and is that really what is that really what I wanted is more attention to this nose and then I got to you know seeing people their cute little noses and every time I saw somebody with a nose ring what did I do I wasn't literally staring at their nose I was looking at their nose ring and I'm like okay well you know drawing more attention the attention's going to their nose their, their nose ring and not their nose and it's something that I want to do and I have two beautiful teenage girls and uh, you know they hit 14, 15, 16 and they want a nose rings and of course dad and I were like no you guys gotta be older and when you're 18 dad's like when you're 18 you can get it and um, so <laughs> you know the one she turned 17 the other one was 19 and I came to a point where I also wanted you know it's like I'm, I'm gonna do this and the cool thing is, let's do it together. So that's another story, doing it together. So when my um, firstborn was uh, three months, I went and had her both her ears pierced. And then um, I got one of my ears pierced. So I had just the two. Actually, I got one with Sunny. And then so with... With the oldest, I got another one done, and then when the second was born, three months later, got hers done. So then I got this this year done, and um, so I thought it would be cool if we all three go and get our nose pierced together. So we did it, and um, hold on just a second. That's another thing. <laughs> My nose drips all the time. It always drips all the time and I thought, oh my gosh, I'm gonna have this thing and Sunny's calling a booger catcher and <laughs> what am I, I do with this? But um, yeah, so if you have been looking at getting a nose ring, of course, I always say with anything, I mean, it's up to you. You decide what's best for you. Um, is it something you truly wanna get? It's a hole 
um, yeah, it does clear it, but it's a big hole. And more than anything, um, it's, it's going to be high maintenance. You've got to make sure that, um, you know, you're cleaning it all the time and um, the amount of time it's going to take to heal. Of course, depending on your body, um, it really depends on your body. But I mean, in the paper I got, it said it could be anywhere from six months to a year. So you're looking, <laughs> okay, that's a long time. Um, but mine's doing really well. It's actually been exactly a week since I got it and I'm having no problems with it at all. It's just, you know, looking for it to not to get red and infected. And um, so long as you clean it twice a day, which I've been doing every morning and every night, then, um, you know, it, you should be fine. And the girls, um, they're doing really good with theirs too. They're not having any issues at all. So, um, and then we did, so I gotta do a shout out to Raw Berry Ink. Um, they're um, a tattoo and piercing place. They're one of our clients actually. And, um, this is a big glare from, there we go. And so they, they're the ones that did it for us. And so they did the whole needle thing. So the needle goes down inside. So you got a nice clean um, piercing rather than a gun, which it's my understanding that can um, break up the tissues in there and make it all jaggedy. And then of course that can be harder to heal. So this, this piercing was so much better. Um, did it hurt? Yes, but really quickly. <laughs> Um, you know, she was very good at what she does, so it was very fast, and she talked you through it. They put this little clamp on it to hold it down so that it numbs it before she puts the piercing in. Jump a little bit, but other than that, didn't it hurt? It hurt. Oh, I hate needles. I hate needles. I, hate needles. I like, I want yeah, to. Yeah, yeah, she does too. She keeps wanting to touch it. Yeah. You don't want to. I want to touch it. <laughs> <laughs> it makes me want to touch it because there's something there, but I won't. You can just put the mirror okay, so in, or the needle in. And so that, um, yeah, I mean, she did very well and it was quick. And afterwards, everybody kept saying, oh my God, they're in so much pain. Oh, my girls are like, mom, it's going to be bleeding. <laughs> and so they kind of were starting to freak me out beforehand. I'm like, bleeding? Why is it going to be bleeding? Like blood, like running down your nose. And they're like, yeah, yeah, you know, I'm like, what? So when I got in there and I sat down, she like wasn't preparing me for my nose bleeding and I would think, okay, if my nose is going to bleed everywhere, they're going to like, you know, just going to cover me with something so I don't get blood dripping down onto my clothes. And you know, she didn't need to, she didn't do that. She didn't need to do that. I mean, there was no blood, no blood between the three of us. Um, and the girls will tell you that, yeah, I mean, it hurts. Um, um, if you've gotten tattoos. I guess Neve said she would rather, which she did go back and get a tattoo, and she's 19 people just so you know, so <laughs> she can do what she wants. So she went and got her second tattoo, and she'd say I'd rather have a tattoo um, than another big piercing. I want to touch it. <laughs> <laughs> it makes me want to touch it because there's something there, but I won't. You can just put the mirror okay, so next to me. So that was her and her opinion, not that it's hurting now or afterwards, I guess just that initial crunch. <laughs> It's so real. I it's can't believe it. I know. <laughs> you want to get it done? Go get it done. Um, you know, if you're insecure like I was and you're worried about it, you know, get over it. I, I can tell you that um, now when I look in the mirror, I actually, I actually like it. Like I look at it and I'm like, it, it doesn't like stand out to me and I'm like oh my god you know what I do and like looking at it all the time like oh crap I you know I look at it and it looks natural it looks like me um it doesn't look any you know out of place to me I love it and um ultimately really um I'm proud of myself like I'm really really proud of myself because I I I've really truly overcome my nose now I like I actually like my nose <laughs> So I went from not li liking my nose um, to a teenager kind of dealing with it to now like um, it's me and I love it and I love the ring and you know what what matters is what I think and not what everybody else thinks so that's my story about getting my my nose piercing I have a couple pictures for you guys to see I'll throw in here so you guys can see that and if you have questions about getting your nose pierced feel free to comment um, or reach out to me. You guys can reach out to me anytime, message me. 
and um, that's it guys take care um, oh my closer so make sure and follow us um, go to follow the badgers.com um, go to support bikers.com and pin yourself on the map so other bikers can find you and um, if you're on YouTube make sure and subscribe to us hit that subscribe and the bell so you get notifications 